Hey. How are you? Decent. How about yourself? Couldn't be better. What do you got going on? Ready to catch some bass, man. Get where it's a little cooler. Sweat. Recording? It says REC on it. Yep. Okay. Well, it's a day in June here. We got Nate. And we're going, what? To a strip club. No. Striper fishing. Oh, yeah. Oh. Stripers. Stripers, not strippers. Only one P. <laughs> so we got a gang coming. Mountain men team and then the Flatlander team. Yeah. <laughs> I don't even know what I'm saying. It's so hot out. Yeah, what is it, 82 something it's like, like that? It's like 182 and the humdidity is a thousand percent. So Nate is with me. We're going to get Jake and then we're going to get K Train and then we're going to the COD for stripers in the surf. This is the Bob. The garbage man, Brant Nananuski. Rotana Nananuski. Soak. Soak. <laughs> We're junkin'. This is the this is the Bob the Garbage Man. Memorial junk. Memorial <laughs> junk. <laughs> and if I see any of you throwing clam bellies, throwing a lures, I'll cut you line. Mooks and momos throwing yo zuris. <laughs> Well, that's what we're doing. We gotta wait for those guys to like get off work or something. But we're gonna get Jake. It's gonna be a long night because it's noon right now and it's like nine, eight hours to the cod. We'll see what's going on. We'll update you. We'll try to make this like a vlog style and just have some fun with this video. <laughs> Jake, Nate. Nice to meet you, man. Let's go get some striper. Three sevenths of the crew here. Hey, we picked up Mr. Canals here. Any words of wisdom? <sighs> Don't work for a living. <laughs> Be a bum and fish every day. Get an OnlyFans and fish every day, exactly. Which way is east? Left. Got it. Now we gotta go find K Train. We're heading Thank east. We gotta drop Jake off at work really quick. It's really hot. My crocs are full sweat. I think this is the first time YouTube seen my cheeks since 2017. How about that? You know what they say? Women love me, fish fear me. Who's they? No one's ever said that, Nate. Yeah. What's going on? Let's get them. We're gonna get them. <laughs> <laughs> I never had too much facial hair until now. <laughs> <laughs> That's one cool one. We What's found that? Kyle. And Dan's vlogging already. <laughs> <laughs> this is gonna be an experience. I wanna document it. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> What's that? What's that? What's that? Proper PPE. That's safe driving. Your thumb needs a hard hat. Well, today's safety topic for today. <laughs> We're gonna just chuck and duck, everyone. Okay, stripers are gonna be cruising. Watch your waiting. And rip, rip the lips. <laughs> or else he would have went under the truck trailer and just churned everything up. I got quilled in the tire though. <laughs> Completely quilled. No flat though. No flat. We gotta be quiet because there's people upstairs. But we're in Cape Cod. We're waiting on Dylan, Chris, and Eric. But this is shop for the next couple days. About it. We're gonna wake up and catch some stripers.
We're gonna catch some of Jake's breakfast first. What do you make in the morning? Making eggs. <laughs> <laughs> How do you we're like them? We're making eggs, sunny side up, sunny side of bacon, bagels with cream cheese, some toast, and some sausage. It's gonna be good. <laughs> What's up, buddy? Go get some striper. Eric, where'd you get those plates? It's a good morning. Got some eggs, some sausage. Uh, whatever that thing is. Punch the clock, punch the bear. How's your drive? It's actually pretty rough. <laughs> Honestly. <laughs> it's actually the silverback. These guys, they're like, hey, we gotta stop. We gotta stop. I'm like, what? I went and got dipping dots. <laughs> I'm sitting there like they're really good. <laughs> Dipping dots are the worst ice cream. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. No, Is this they like got like a. They're like really when they hit your tongue, they just kind of like <laughs> they stick, you know. It's, it's very they nice. Use. We got a craving for the dots. There's nothing you can do but just eat them. You know what I'm saying? It was a good catfish, but yeah. it wasn't a forty-pound catfish. Rod was bent over like a candy cane. You're right, dude. Snozberries taste like schnozberries. Snozberries and snozberries. <laughs> Mom says I can't I can't go fishing if I don't brush my teeth. <laughs> Cause my heart is in a fire. We'll catch some big big fat cows out here. I don't know if we're going to the surf canal. I'm Starting off with a tried and true golden bunker. It's gonna work great. Hey, hey, hey. Oh. Hey. <laughs> the thirties aren't gonna catch themselves. <laughs> Big salmon river guy. That's right. We go. Snag him and bag him. <laughs> Alright, it's the morning of the first day. Gang's loaded up. The gang's all here. Only four dudes got the mustache memo. memo so. What do you got in there? It's a golden bunker, you know. Take a look in here. If I can get it open. Yeah, I don't know. I think that perch is still good. See, that has got that nice slime on it. Good bunker. <laughs> 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 Where did you get that pet? Minners won't last long in a bucket with water. And I was like, dude, your math is off. <laughs> Way off. Calibrate. This is weird. Dude, that guy had an accent. It's the first time I ever heard a Boston accent in my whole entire life. It's awesome. This is like completely different. I thought this was going to be like an Ocean City type thing. Nah, man, this no is like way. its own yeah, ecosystem. We found our first wildlife. Is it a shed? It's a shed, dude. Crab shed. <laughs> <laughs> the shell, the crab shed. I didn't know they had sheds in Boston. Well, Massachusetts, I should say. That was proof found in shed. That's a dead head. Yeah, dead head. <laughs> yes, sir. All right, we're getting ready to go out on the soak. Everybody's rigged up. It's very windy, and I'm gonna do a lot of fishing, so I don't know how much is gonna get recorded. But if someone catches something, I'm gonna run over and film it. Bear with the wind, though. that Christopher missed one so I said I'm gonna throw it out there you know what do you know nice fish Dylan I just picked one up this is my second one a little schoolie on the clouser A 
brief recap of the morning session. What are you guys thinking? Did pretty good. Dylan got a big one. Pretty successful day. Help we save the lifeguards. And we are the lifeguards. We're catching fish, not crazy. We got into them there at the end, but the tide was coming in so quickly, so we had to bail so we wouldn't die. Got 99 problems, but a fish ain't one. Mm. Where the strap is at? <laughs> <laughs> Them high mountain folk know how to catch salt water. You ain't salt life, you ain't nothing, brother. Mm, you're taking a right. <laughs> I guess we're gonna try to hunt up a pizza here and get back after them stripers in, uh, in the afternoons. I ain't catching any fish, go ahead. Caught a couple, you know. I caught one on a jerk bait, but. Tell ya, tell Open till four. They don't open till four. They don't open what till. is wrong with these states? <laughs> golden bunker. Go yeah, the he... golden bunker. The fish is in Lake Wallen, Paul Pack, PA. Yeah, Just hit me in the back of the head and gave me a paper cut. Wanna do a little quiz? Yeah. Let's see. Give me a. Alright, Dan. What is number 15? The brown bullhead. The one, the one next to it. Sorry. Oh, yeah, it is. <laughs> 23. So, Wal Walleye. Walleye. Yeah. Five. Making or break it. It's a white sucker. Woo! Dan Collins with the white sucker number five. <laughs> Round him up. There you go. Nice blue. Nice blue on top water. We saw the we saw a bunch of birds hitting bait. So we decided to throw top water. Bait came from it. Good, you know. Three pound blue. few fish in the bag, one blue, a couple stripers, windier than a mother out there. That's a bass thumb right there. Didn't you slip and fall in the parking lot? <laughs> no, you didn't see that, that wasn't on camera. <laughs> I got sand in my cheeks, sand in my reel. <laughs> what happened? Lost, lost, man. That was a good one. Day two, day two, day, day two, two, day two, two, day two, two, two. On the buy that boss bass. Day two. Look at this bit. Check it out. Afco. Uh -oh. Firehole. Ooh. LL Bean. Ooh. Crocs. <laughs> you ain't crocking. You ain't rocking. Walmart real tree. I've been waiting all morning and I think I've soiled my linens. Morning. Morning. Day two. Day two? Day two, day two, day two. Just brush my teeth. Um, usually I don't brush my teeth during hunting and fishing trips, but Dan really taught me the importance of that. You know, fresh teeth, fresh mind. Maybe we can catch bass a little bit more efficiently. Good idea. Can I borrow your toothpaste? <laughs> can I actually borrow your toothpaste? Yeah. I thought you just found some. I did, but he's <laughs> in there. <laughs> I really don't want to brush my teeth, but a man is <laughs> next to me. <laughs> oh, hi. Playing with Zara Tanza. Playing with something? Is that a plopper whopper? I've been, I, yeah, I've been using a plopper whopper now for a little over 10 years. I bought this. 
I just want the shape to be better. Man, do better. You'd be dumb if you didn't sell it. Jeez, that's dumb. Where's the wind going? It's still going on the base. $10,000 fine. Yeah, that's not bad. 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 Nice fish. Dinner, huh? Heck yeah. I guess make tacos or nuggets or whatever. He said, uh, I think a seal got your blue. And he came over running oh. like crazy. fish right now I've snapped off four and then I put on a steel leader shouldn't have taken me that long to put one on <laughs> and then I just landed one there but everybody's catching blues and I just want to get one with the fly and I'll start filming people you can just see the skulls just cruise into these flats and then you throw it in there and they just hammer it it's awesome Right in the face. Right in the face. I'm pretty committed to the fly life right now. Nice. <laughs> That's right. Uh, so yeah, we got two bluefish here, and we're playing them up. Uh, just kind of doing it like a big blue, I mean like a big bluegill. Bluefish like, bluegill. We're really not sure what we're doing, but uh, we're making it work. We're gonna make some tacos out of it. The morning bite was very lackluster. In total, between the two, the two vehicles, we paid one hundred and ten dollars in parking for zero fish. <laughs> uh, went to a new spot. Get out on the jetty. We. First cast, I catch a striper, catch some little schoolies, and all of a sudden, all hell breaks loose. Yeah. The bluefish massacre. Eric caught a billion fish. Everybody caught giant bluefish. It was a blast. Yeah. Top water, up. flies, jerk baits. 
big old nine inch plugs. We're getting bit off, lost a bunch of baits yeah, all together. We probably lost over 200 bucks of lures. Yeah, we probably lost about 12 baits all total, not including flies. I don't know how many flies you guys lost, but. Now what? Make some fish tacos. <laughs> now, now what? No, uh, I think we're gonna make some fish tacos. <laughs> <laughs> now what? Now we make some fish tacos. I don't know what the set we're looking for. Ugh. And now what? Now we just chill out, man. <laughs> make some fish tacos. Fish tacos. No. What do you want me to say? And now what? I'm lost. What do you want me to say? Chris, and now what? Fish tacos. <laughs> And now what? <laughs> More fish tacos. <laughs> Hurry up. Fish tacos. <laughs> Who's the best mustache here? Is there a question? It's me. Who has the best mustache here? Okay, so you guys all have great mustache. Let's start off with that. I like Proogs a lot because he also has the hair and the mustache. He had the glasses too. He took those off. Jake's is just clean. That's just like a military mustache. Thank you for, thank you for your service. And you, you gotta love the like the scruff with the handlebar mustache, like the day old handlebar. You can never go wrong with that. With a feather in his cap. That that's just that's just old school. Why didn't you mention mine? No, I was getting to you, Dan. Don't worry. <laughs> and then Dan's. I can't even see who's at the camera crazy. That that's classic too. You know what I mean? You can't go wrong with just the, the classic handlebar with a little bit of five o'clock shadow. That's just swagging. Now let's eat some fish tacos. So, so <laughs> I think in context, I'm going to say Nate. Because Nate, I, I didn't even recognize him. I thought that was Bob the garbage man sitting inside the house when we walked in. So I, that's my vote. Two uh, blues, two striper, a few hundred bar mustaches. Good times rolling. Nate has the best mustache here. <laughs> but Dylan. Mine's Dylan's long. is good, but nothing compared to Nate. I don't know. Nate's. Nothing I, I don't know. Like Mine's blonde, so yeah, like yeah. it's just automatically you better. See it for more than 10 but years. I do appreciate the size. And I got a mullet too, so yeah, like exactly. everybody loves a mullet, you know. Look out. <laughs> Bombs ahoy. That guy's good. We're looking at some <laughs> We're looking at some beat up lures from today. <laughs> we did some we did some beat up lures for this. <laughs> 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 we got here though. Just some teeth mocks. The hat barely made it. <clears throat> yep, my pretty face here. You don't see much of it in this video. Great day, Nate. Nate's shaking his head yes. Salt water is sweet. <laughs> I'm loving this. I don't know how much we're gonna love these bluefish, but uh, if you burn it, it all tastes the same. Whether it's a a cheese it or a pizza or a blue fish or a blue gill. It's all gonna taste the same if you burn it. Am I wearing the same shirt as yesterday? No, I have two of these. A lot of fish hit the bank today. I'll tell you that. I maybe caught three fish, got bit off by blue fish, forgot they had teeth, and I'm like, man, why are they snapping 15 pound test? Bite me off. Dug in Jake's bag real deep and yeah, found a steel leader. So uh, us fly guys, we gotta stick together, you know? And it's it's not it's not fun watching your buddy lose, you know, eight, $9 fly. So me, Jake, and K-Train pass the rod to each other, you know? It was a good time. You know, we're, we're working together too. These other guys aren't working together. We're spotting fish. We're a bit like telling them, hey, what's up? You know, fish co school coming. These other guys are just like all for themselves, really selfish. 100 yards out. Yeah, bombing, bombing 120 yard cast. Yeah, they're gonna catch fish. We, you know, us fly guys, we gotta stick together. We we don't just blindly cast into the water, wasting time. We sit there. We 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 relax. We save our casting arm. We reminisce. We talk a little BS. We have some fun. We're just bonding. You know, it's a more of an experience when you're fly fishing rather than chucking lures. So we're working together. Jake's like, "Yo, school's coming in." 20 school, yards school, out. School coming in. Fish coming in. And I'm like, on your left. I'm like, there's more cursing. Playing it in there. We're, yep. Like I said, it's fly, us fly guys, we gotta work together. When we're fishing the harbor, 
you got the canal over here and you got the flats over here and the blues are blitzing through you got to act quick and you need to work together these guys fish and lures every man for himself you know i ain't against it but dog I, mean, dog I chucked wolf. a lure i chucked a lure today chris chris was helping other guys land fish that's why chris didn't catch many fish that's what he says um, <laughs> Chris put his rod down. Never put your rod down on a soak. Chris put his rod down on the soak. I pick it up, throw it away, but play it. Crawling that thing in there. I hooked one. Uh, that was the only lure I chucked today. Um, all in all, good day. Got some Dunkin' Donuts. Um, inflation is a thing now. We couldn't have picked a better time to take a road trip fishing with these gas prices. Low as dirt. Lower than dirt. Cheap as dirt. What else can I say? Chris said he's going to take the, the teeth out of the bluefish and he's going to make an anklet. If he's making a, an anklet out of bluefish teeth, I would expect him to not climb mountains this fall for mountain bucks because he's going to slice his Achilles. And this isn't the same show as yesterday. Absolute mayhem on a jetty. Started as chaos, settled in as mayhem. <laughs> what do you got? Blue what's blue on your chair there? I think it's popsicles. <laughs> Rocket <Rock and pop. laughs> 1990s Romeo and Juliet with Leonardo DiCaprio in it. That's the greatest movie of all time. Oh yeah, Grace said the time. Don't tell mom the babysitter's dead. <laughs> <laughs> we need Mikowski and we need Josh Grazzi. There's a bluefish. That's right. Cause they're rocking right now. They're so good. They're so good. Mm -hmm. It's better. It's better than Long John Silver's. Yo, I like the way you did that. Rice and beans. Yeah, rice, fish, coleslaw. That's how it ought to be. Yo, mm. there's this chef. Oh shit. Are you good? Oh. Unfortunately, he got married last week. <laughs> <laughs> Love you, Pookie. <laughs> <laughs> Can't clean up. All good things must come to an end, huh? Me and the boys hit him hard. The Blue Blitz of 22, Sacco Ab, Mayhem on the Jetty, Nashville Fishing Day Blitz of 22. For Bob, for Dennis, for Abella, drinks poured for you. From Rural PA, the Mountain Boys and the Flatties. Then we got a blue fishy with a plug sticking out of his mouth. Right. We go in the canal. We're gonna try and hit the canal. I said the canal. We're going to the canal. We're going He's for an hour. hour. We might as well we're here. Go to the canal. Nate, we're hitting the canal. Hey. hey. I got my khakis. He's got his khakis. <laughs> khakis <laughs> and khakis. <laughs> khakis. <laughs> khakis. Thank you, old friend. You did as well. Closing down in the cod with the boys. We're on our last soak here on the canal. Saw one fish. Osprey caught a fish. So we saw two fish, no one hooked up, current was ripping through there, but that's it, that's a, that's a Cape Cod trip. Now we got a long haul home, we're trying to find a Chipotle or a Moe's or an Arby's or try to find something to eat now, but uh, that's the Cape Cod adventure with the boys. Any words? Thanks for having us out here. Jake, hey, thanks hey, for the yeah. good guide. Best salt water hey, trip. Jake Janaus. Next Cake, year. Cake Janaus. Cake Janaus here. We'll be back for sure for a longer time. Maybe get into some bigger stripers. Next year, five days. And steel leaders. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> steel leaders, a bunch of plugs. Yeah, steel leaders. There's K Train. I'm never leaving my house to go fishing without steel leaders. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Good trip. Yeah. Good trip. Catch food. Why the way you guys are screaming through your bowels? I don't know. If we want to eat bluefish the whole trip. <laughs> <laughs> we wouldn't get any. You'd fish one day and then you eat bluefish and you guys would all die. <laughs> and I'd be out there on the soap in <laughs> AC. I'll let you get your slice of last words, Mr. Waitered up, ready to go fishing again. Are you gonna wear your waiters into Chipotle? No, I'm gonna go into Chipotle and find the bathroom. I gotta make room. How would you describe your trip? It was pretty dang good. We got into them. Everybody caught fish, so that's all that matters. Everybody had a good time. Uh, the mustache really got the fish fired up. Yeah. Good day. Stay hard.
<laughs> Stay hard. What are we getting into later? We're getting into fish tacos <laughs> later, so.